Hi everybody, this is Diana from Sweet Isalado, and today we're going to make arepas santanderianas, which is another version of Colombian arepas, and these are made with fried pork belly and cassava. Really easy to make, and they're amazing. As always, the link for this recipe can be found at the end of the video and in the info box below. So the main ingredient we need for this recipe is yellow hominy corn, or maíz trillado, or maíz peto, and this is what it looks like. We're going to place it in a bowl and we're going to take out any bad stuff that may come with it like rocks or bugs or whatever you may find. Then we're going to rinse it under cold water. I like to do it three times and then drain it. And then we're gonna finally cover it with plenty of water and let it soak overnight. The next day, we're gonna drain it and place it in a medium pot. We're gonna cover it with plenty of water and season with salt. We're gonna cover this and bring it to a boil on high heat. And once it's boiling, we're gonna bring it down to medium low and cook for about two hours or until the hominy is nice and tender. Then we're gonna drain it and let it cool completely. Once it's cool and dry, we're gonna grind it. I'm using a food processor. You can use a food grinder if you want. We're also gonna add some cooked cassava, which is really easy to make. You just boil it for about 10 minutes in salted water or until tender. And then we add fried pork belly. I have the recipe on how to make this fried pork belly on the channel, so I'm gonna leave you the link for that video in the info box below. We cover our food processor, and then we're gonna grind this until we get a very nice and smooth dough. Once it's ready, we're gonna taste for seasoning, and if it needs more salt, you can add it right now. And then we're gonna let it rest for about 20 minutes. Then to make the arepas, we're gonna grab a small amount of dough, then we're gonna roll it into a ball, and then we're gonna flatten it. I like to use a tortilla press, but if you don't have one of these, you can flatten it by using the bottom of a dish or the bottom of a pot. Now we're gonna add a little bit of oil or butter to a hot pan. Then we add the arepas. And we're gonna cook them on medium high for about three to five minutes or until they're golden brown on both sides. Because remember, all of the ingredients that we used are already cooked. And once they're golden brown on both sides, they're ready to serve. And that's how easy it is to make arepas santanderianas. If you enjoyed this video and this recipe, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to this channel so you're up to date with all the videos that I upload in the future. And don't forget that you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, and Google+. Thanks everybody for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye, and buen provecho.